What are three <coughs> tips that they could take away and implement well, into their home? First of all, take a break. And, and think of an emergency break in your car, right? If you're disagreeing in front of your boys, that's not good for them, and it's certainly not good for the two of you. You're talking about resentment. So think of a break, a hand signal, a safe word, or just the phrase, we're going to talk about this later, your dad and I, or your mom and I, and then make sure you talk about it. So my second tip is to make a list, a checklist of behaviors that will be rewarded and punished. So for example, What's writing... That? That you should do with your girlfriends or Bethany or someone else. But um, should your sons be wearing a bicycle helmet when they're on their scooter or their bicycle? Do you guys disagree about that? Get on yes. the same page yeah. about that. So they should have a same page yeah, list of guidelines and regulations or a chart. So they're together. One. Yeah, again, yeah, you could refer him to the chart. That's, mm -hmm. a, good, that's a good one. Exactly, like one. and you could refer her to the chart, Absolutely. too. It works both yes. ways, Bethany. Yes. Okay, yes. And my third tip, really, what? was was to, um, where, when you have areas of disagreement, you know, write them down. So you may write down, I think you're overreacting, and your job would be to just read it back. What's the point of that? Just to make sure that you communicated it and that it was heard in a respectful way. Then circle back to my second tip, which is that checklist of being...